Hey everybody, welcome back to Jamia's promo. And today we're gonna talk about a brand new Samsung One UI 2.1 update. And it pushes an update to your Samsung photo editor, giving you the ability of using Spot Fixer. Spot Fixer is a way that you can simply just get rid of or hide blemishes and pimples, and at least in this case, a scratch. So let's head back inside of the gallery, going from the very beginning to show you how you can do this. So once you go in the gallery, you first wanna find the image that you would like to fix or edit. So in this case, we're gonna do this picture here, but there's gonna be a couple more that we'll also do just to give you more examples. Now, because this photo has a face that is being recognized, it will give you the ability of doing any type of a face edit. So what I mean by that is when you hit on this edit icon, if this was a scenery or landscape photo, the very last image on the very bottom will not pop up, which is just dealing with everything with your face, you know, going from the tone over into smoothness, uh, making your eyes a little bit larger, or smaller, you can fix your jawline or change it. Uh, then this is the one that we're talking about today, which is spot fixer, but you also can change the background blur and also fix red eye. Now with this picture here, I took an image trying to show off just how long his eyelashes are, but that scratch is sitting right there. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna keep it right at this little you know, position right here zoomed in, and you do wanna use two fingers, making sure you can do that, because from now on when I use one finger, it will be using that spot fixer. So let's go through, let's make this little dot a little bit larger. Now I'm gonna pull in a little bit from this wider area, and then I'm going to cover that little scratch. And then if you needed to go over it just a few more times, you can do that. You kind of want to take a look at all of the colors that's kind of around the eye. That's going to show you kind of where it's, it's going to pull from. Then the next thing that I might want to do is let's say that we have a, another small little baby scratch right over there. So we're going to make that a little bit longer so it gets a lighter toned. Uh, so we got rid of that little baby scratch. Now, everything else, it's it's fine. I mean, he's a baby, he has a little bit of dry skin, you know, a little bit of uh, redness right over there. If I needed to go through and fix it just a little bit more, you can go inside of the smoothness and then you can take down just a little bit of that little redness on his cheeks. But other than that, this is a really good image. Uh, we got rid of that scratch. You can hit on that little check box uh, and then let's kind of go over here maybe would like to put this thing over inside of, uh, I don't know, maybe like a grayscale. Uh, so you can do something like this, and then now you're able to post this image up. The last thing I would do when I'm done with this one was I'd actually hit on save. Now that this is the, the final result, the original was sitting right there, I'd maybe go in just like this, kind of give this one a little bit of a crop, maybe sitting right there. And then now when you hit on that small image, so now what you're doing is you're going from this original image, doing all of the editing on your phone over into this shot. I mean, this is just breathtaking. I think that this is actually pretty sick, a uh, really good image. Uh, but now let's go over into a few of the other photos. So now let's go over just a few more examples. So let's go back over here. Uh, let's go over into this photo right here. So this is just me and my little dudes. Uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back inside of edit. And because this, this image recognized faces, then you're gonna have the face on the bottom right hand side. Let's move right over here into this little spot fixer. Now let's just say that we wanted to go through and if I went into my image a little bit closer, so I got a little bit of a scratch right there as well. Again, from the little dude, if you go through and you put in a little line with your, your spot fixer, it is now gone. Uh, and then for some weird reason, I mean, this is just something that I have, it's a scar, but let's say for some reason you wanted to get rid of it. And also just so you can see what it looks like when it is gone. Uh, so now I just completely got rid of that entire image. Some people make comments that when you put your skin over into, or you, you change the smoothness of your skin, it's a little bit too exaggerated. It's a little bit too extreme. So with my, my Wi-Fi forehead right here, what I'd be able to do is let's say that we bring uh, that spot filler up or spot fixer up just a little bit larger. You'd be able to go through and you can just maybe get rid of some of these, um, these little lines on the top. So this will take a little bit of time getting it exactly how you want it to look just because it is pulling in color from other areas. So let's say that this one was just a little bit better than what it looked like from before. 
and then now when you go out you're gonna have a little bit less forehead wi-fi signal if you know what i mean i could have spent a little bit more time and actually went slower and made it look way better but i'm giving you an example of something that you're able to do now let's say that we just go right on back there you go with that original image now the very last picture that we're going to play with is going to be with his image just one more time so with this picture right here we're going to do pretty much almost the same thing so we're going to go right back inside hit on this little edit button this is where we kind of talked about with that smoothness so when you actually bring this up quite a bit it might be a little bit too extreme but we're going to put it right there in terms of baby faces smoothness works really well versus adults so we're going to keep that sitting right there let's go back over into this uh, small spot fixer so there is that little scratch completely got rid of it uh, so now let's move right on back and so now we got another image very similar to before but you can kind of see what you're able to do it's actually pretty nice uh, but again you can go through you can play with a few of these other things you have background blur you also have your your uh, red eye fix this is the jawline this is to make your eyes you know look a little bit wider uh, make it look a little bit different smoothness as well as the tone but again, if you guys liked this video, if this video has helped you guys out, 87% of people viewing this video is not subscribed. So if you found this to be helpful, hit that subscribe button, join the party. It is free to subscribe. But again, if you guys like this video, give this thing a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to hit on subscribe. Subscribe right over here in the very bottom left hand side. And if you like this video, then more than likely you'll also like this video. And I'll see you guys later.